what is up everybody welcome back to the channel coming at you today with another massive retail rip hit up a couple targets today and was actually able to get really lucky again must have just hit the restock um, because as you can see we're getting to actually rip into a mega box of panini playbook a blaster of panini contenders a hanger box of tops chrome and then we actually have some single packs of Heritage High Number. And as you can see, these are not your average retail packs. These are actually hobby packs that we were able to find loose and sit in there. The interesting thing about today's hunt is that while we were at Target, we actually found that the Target was actually selling hobby boxes of Heritage High Number. They were running about $120 for the Hobby Box, which is a little bit more than you're probably going to see them going for. Um, I know my local Hobby Shop has them for about $90 to $100. I think I've seen them on eBay running anywhere from $80 to $90, give or take. Um, but what I did think was interesting is that those Hobby Boxes are actually starting to pop up on... Target retail shelves. It'll be interesting if at that price, that $120 price, if they're going to actually be able to be moved off of those shelves, or if people are going to actually let those be and kind of have an indicator if those targets are being picked over, if they're being picked up, restocked, whatever. Um, so Without getting any further into that, what we're going to do today is we're going to be opening up all of this that you see in front of us. Um, it's going to be another little longer video, but I'm super excited to rip into this, especially the mega box of playbooks, see what autograph we can get. Um, we've opened all of these products before, so we're going to look real quick at some of the stuff we picked up out of this before. Um, earlier in the year, I ripped into Heritage High Number. And actually pulled this um, action variation of Dallas Keuchel. And we also ripped a couple um, Panini Playbook hanger boxes. And pulled this Jalen Hurts. And this Justin Herbert purple variation. Um, so hopefully, um, especially with the autograph or memorabilia card in here, um, we'll have some good luck. Fingers crossed we'll be able to pull another rookie QB. Um, so go ahead right now. If you are not already subscribed, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Um, click that bell to get a notification when we're posting new videos. And go ahead and hit that like button. And we will see what we are able to pull out of these um, kind of mix of everything we got going on. So first things first, we're going to start off with Heritage High Number. And see what we are actually able to and get from these hobby packs. So we got five hobby packs that we're going to be opening. And we will see what luck we're able to find. Didi Gregorius, Rich Hill, Junior Guerrera, Michael Walker, World Series Highlights, uh, Jose Rodriguez rookie card, Carlos Rodon, Tony Kemp, and Mitch Moreland. So again, while I was at Target, seeing those hobby boxes of Heritage High Number was something that really, really threw me off. Haven't ever seen hobby boxes make their way into a retail setting before. Um, I know that Walmart was doing Heritage High Number hanger boxes that actually had hobby packs in them, um, but actually hadn't seen a full-on hobby box before. Uh, Dylan Bat Batance, CJ Crone, Cole Calhoun, Blake Trainin, Nestor Cortez, Josh Fagley, Franklin Barreto, Steve uh, Kaishik and Jalen Beeks. Um, at the end of these, we'll go through and we'll check for any image variations we have. 
Um, and I'll also have to pay close attention as we're doing these um, because the uh, the autographs that are in Heritage High Number are blue um, and blend in really well with the uh, normal black um, signatures that are on the cards normally for these. Nick Castellanos, Tyrone Taylor, Kyle Gibson, Jarrell Cotton, uh, Now and Then, North of the Border, Bo Bichette. Garrett Cole, Brock Holt, uh, Joannis Cespedes, and Daniel Hudson. So three packs into the Heritage, not that, uh, I don't think we've hit any big hits on this end with it. Um, we'll have to see if that continues. Um, like I said, we'll go back and we'll look and see if there's actually any of the um, retail, or not retail, but image variations on them. I don't think we've seen any yet, but we may have. Uh, Jake Maris Marisnik, Kyle Farmer, Adolis Garcia, uh, Philly's Friends, Reese Hoskins, and Bryce Harper, Luis Guillerme, Guillerme for the Mets, Frankie Montas, Todd Frazier, Willie Castro, rookie. And last pack of Heritage High Number. Before we move on to some of the newer stuff. Jason Castro. Oh, looks like we got a hit in here. Oh, and I see Ozzy. I'm really hoping that's an Ozzy Albies. We'll flip that to the back, though, and we'll see. Maybe Ozzy Smith. But either way, we're not going to be upset about it. Uh, Robbie Grossman. Tommy Malone. Kevin Ginkle. DJ Stewart. Yeah, and as you can see, that's definitely a thicker card on the back. So super excited about that. Jason Castro. Matt Joyce. Matt Whistler. And uh, it is an Ozzy Albies relic. Absolutely love that. As you guys know, huge Braves fan. And to pull that out of the pack, that is pretty awesome. Because those were just five loose packs that were sitting there. Um, and sitting there waiting to be kind of picked through. I figured people had already kind of searched them. And, you know, last pack magic. So we will go ahead and get that in a penny sleeve at least right now. I don't actually have any top loaders that will fit the memorabilia cards. That's a little upsetting right now. But there you go. Ozzy Albies game use memorabilia. So, sticking with baseball, let's go ahead and open up this Topps Chrome Update Series hanger pack. Um, I actually didn't get to open any Update Series regular this year. I kind of held off on that because I knew people were reviewing it and not enjoying it a lot. I didn't necessarily like the, um, the checklist that was there for it and kind of just held off on it, didn't do anything on that end. Um, but definitely happy to give it a chance to open up the Chrome series, so let's see what we get. On the back, Trent Grisham. And is that, that might be a hit. It looks like we definitely have a thicker card there. Could just be a refractor, but we're going to flip that to the back just in case and see what we have. Um, so Gabe Spear, Trent Grisham, Todd Frazier, and we have an auto out of this. Holy cow, what luck. A Nick Kiafo for the Rangers. Don't know too, too much about him, but... An autograph out of a hanger box. I will absolutely take this. We are having some 
monster luck today. And hopefully it continues. So, auto number one. Let me know in the comments, guys, if you have had some luck ripping into this, um, if you've been able to find any as you've been looking around for it, and, you know, what your, uh, what your opinion of it is. Um, Boba Shett, rookie. A Nico Horner, decades next for 2020. Philip Dial. And Yoshi Sutsugo for the Rays. So we're hitting a lot of good rookie cards in this so far. Well, I guess not necessarily great rookies, but um, rookies nonetheless, which is always fun to find in these. In these packs. Uh, next, we have Wilmer Flores. <laughs> there he is, Randy Rose Arena. Absolutely fantastic. Thrilled to pull that. Love the look of that card with his follow-through on his swing. Uh, and the last two on here, Yasmani Grandal and Cole Calhoun. So, I'm going to go ahead and get this Randy into a sleeve real quick before we go any further. Um, obviously, the big release that's happening this year, or this week, sorry, it actually is going to be happening tomorrow. Um, we're filming this on Tuesday, February 9th, and tomorrow is actually the release of Top Series 1 for 2021. Um, don't have any stored away yet. I'm going to try to get a couple packs so I can rip into them and actually see. I'm um, super excited to see um, some of the Braves who are listed on that checklist. Um, Ian Anderson's rookie card is going to be in there. Um, along with um, a uh, Kristen Pache's rookie card. And super excited for the both of those um, players to be actually up in the big leagues. Both had monster postseasons for the Braves last year. So hopefully we can get into that and actually rip open some of those packs and see where we go from there. Uh, Glaber, All-Star Game. <laughs> oh, no way. King Griffey Jr., Home Run Derby, 1994. Wow, so, guys, this was an absolutely loaded hanger pack. Um, I'm going to get that Griffey back on s screen a little bit more. Um, I want to say that this is Griffey's first Chrome card, or the first set that he was actually in Chrome for. Um, so to pull that base and I mean that's just a gorgeous card looking at his follow through on that end and what we're going to look at now our pink refractor um, you get two of these in every hanger box and Edwin Encarnacion and from the Brewers Logan Morrison so not great refractors, Encarnacion's not a bad one to pull, but um, the hits that we've had out of this have definitely definitely put those to, to kind of bed. So Ken Griffey, Randy Rosarena, and the Nick Kiafo rookie, or not rookie, but Nick Kiafo autograph. All right, so let's go ahead and we will open up Contenders next, um, and then we'll move on to Playbook for last. Um, now we should be able to get an auto in this, or, sorry, auto or memorabilia. Um, it says one on average per box. Um, obviously there are the um, boxes that Panini has that have points instead. Um, so go ahead and if you haven't already, hit that like button. Hopefully we will continue to have some good luck on this side and be able to um, either pull that auto or that memorabilia card instead of a uh, Panini points card. So we'll see. This card kind of feels a little 
thicker than normal, but I could just be making that up. And on the back, you have the kid reporter. So DJ Moore, Ryan Fitzpatrick, wrong Dolphins QB, Tyron Matthew, Alvin Kamara, Todd Gurley, Jalen Ramsey, and here's our auto, I believe. Nope. Rookie patch of Joshua Kelly. Really like that card, actually. It's got the green background on it. And I want to say Kelly is out of the University of Tennessee. Nope, UCLA. Never mind. So... There's our hit for the box, I believe, and sitting right behind it, Rookie of the Year contenders, Tua. I was too busy paying attention to that Josh Kelly patch that passed completely up on the um, probably bigger part of that. So we'll leave that in our hit pile. Well, the good news on this is, is we did get an actual hit. We didn't get stuck with uh, points or anything like that. So... Even though it's not a fantastic hit, you know we'll we'll take it and we'll uh, we'll go from there. Brandon Cooks, Tyler Lockett, Nick Chubb, Saquon, Super Bowl champion Tom Brady, Drew Locke, uh, Tradari Tradavius White, MVP contenders Kyler Murray. <clears throat> Darius Leonard, James Conner, Amari Cooper, Josh Allen for the Jaguars, Terry McLaurin, Matt Stafford, newly anointed QB of the Los Angeles Rams. Jimmy Garoppolo, and a Rookie of the Year contender for Isaiah Simmons and the kid reporter for the Super Bowl. Alright, so two more packs left in contenders, and then we will jump into the big hit, the Playbook Mega Box. And hopefully, uh, knock on wood, we'll keep up our luck, and we will have another hit in that box. So, Derek Carr, Christian McCaffrey, Adam Thielen, Travis Kelsey, Khalil Mack, Michael Thomas, Marquise Brown, and round numbers insert for... Uh, Yator Gross Matos and KJ Hamler for the Broncos. Alright, last pack Philip Lindsay, Josh Jacobs, Tyler Boyd, Kirk Cousins. Devontae Adams, DK Metcalf, Odell Beckham Jr., and an MVP contenders of Michael Thomas. Okay, so not a fantastic blaster, um, but not a bad one either. I'll go ahead real quick, and while we are waiting, we'll get these two in some sleeves. Um, definitely the big hit out of there um, is the Tua Rookie of the Year Contenders card. I actually really like how that background kind of pops with their um, jerseys they have. And last but not least, um, Playbook Mega Box. Like I said, um, we're going to be looking at not a lot of cards in here, 20 cards, uh, 5 per pack and 4 per box. 
Um, but we are going to hopefully have either one autograph or memorabilia card in here. Um, fingers crossed we keep up the good luck that we've had so far, and we get another big hit. Um, so while we are getting this opened up, go ahead, guys. Like I said before, if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel. Um, hit that bell to be notified when we go live or whenever we put out new um, videos. Um, I know I have a couple that are in the works right now to get everything out and get everything done. Um, and last but not least, hit that like button um, and keep up the good mojo for us on this end. Um, as we are going through on this. So looking at them, unfortunately they're all looking kind of thin. Um, hopefully that means we have an auto. Hope that doesn't mean we have a um, Panini Points card, like I said earlier. We will see. So, starting off, Nick Chubb, AJ Brown. Uh, next up, of uh, Chenault Jr. for the Jaguars. Um, Antoine Whitfield Jr. And Justin Jefferson, nice little rookie card hit there. All right, on the pack number two. I know this video is going kind of long. Appreciate you guys sticking it out to the very end. Uh, Taysom Hill, Aaron Rodgers. Another Vikings rookie, a purple this time, of Jeff Gladney. T. Higgins rookie card. And Ben DiNucci from the Cowboys. Alright, two packs left. Kyle Van Noy. Oh, looks like we have a hit there, so we'll flip that to the back. Those Jaguars, I'm thinking it's Chenault, but we will see for sure. Uh, Hunter Henry. Oh, nice Chase Claypool rookie card. Kyle Duggar rookie card for the Patriots. Uh, there's that Van Noy, and yeah, flip this down this way. No, it is Colin Johnson, wide receiver from the Jacksonville Jaguars, and it is his auto. So, um, another rookie auto, not the one we were necessarily looking for, for sure, but not a bad one to have pulled. Um, anytime you can get the autos out of retail, you definitely take it and um, you roll with it. So... Last pack, let's see if we can pull some magic, pull one of the big rookie QBs, uh, Justin Herbert, Tua, um, Jalen Hurts, or Joe Burrows, and let's see what we can get. Keenan Allen, Devin Bush, a purple of Alshon Jeffrey, A Gabriel Davis, and last card is going to be a 49er, a Jawan Jennings rookie card um, for the 49ers. Actually, not a bad hit for me. I live in Knoxville, so um, obviously Jawan played at the University of Tennessee, so not a bad hit overall, but not a super, super great one on this end with it. Um, but all in all, cannot complain one bit. We had monster hits out of this and everything we landed on this end. Uh, started off the Ozzy Albies game used memorabilia card from Heritage. Uh, Tua, Rookie of the Year contender. Isaiah Simmons, Rookie of the Year contender. Uh, Joshua Kelly, Rookie Ticket um, game used memorabilia. Then back to Topps Chrome Update, the Ken Griffey Jr., Randy Rosarena. That's one of my favorite. I'll get the comp for you guys during editing on this. I know that's one of the um, hot, 
items for Chrome, um, both of these and the Griffey Jr. Uh, the Nick Kiefo, I think I'm pronouncing that right, but probably not. But anyway, his autograph. Then from Playbook, we had the Chase Claypool rookie card, the base, uh, the Colin Johnson rookie auto, and the base Justin Jefferson. So all in all, fantastic opening. Um, well worth you know taking that trip out to Target tonight. Um, so guys, go ahead, do me a favor, like I said, hit that like button, subscribe, click the bell, um, and we will be back to you with another um, video here shortly. Um, you click the link right now, you'll see our last video up there, and it'll take you to it. Go ahead, check it out, um, take a look at some of the playlists that are up, some of our other retail hunts, and have a good rest of your evening.